Ish Devdas, the other breaking story coming in. The centre has submitted an affidavit response to petitions filed by Ashwini Upadhyay seeking uniform rules of divorce, adoption and guardianship, which are the components of the Uniform Civil Code. In its reply, the centre has said that citizens belonging to different religions and denominations following different property and matrimonial laws an affront on nation's unity. UCC divests personal law center. Uh, in fact, they go on to say that court cannot direct drafting of UCC. It is a policy matter. Harish, so strong response there on the Uniform Civil Code. Once again, the debate over UCC back in the limelight. Yes, that's right. Uh, this uh, this affidavit has been exclusively accessed by the uh, by Times Network. Uh, in fact, in one line, uh, if we explain uh, what the center says, the center regarding says regarding the uh, Uniform Civil Code that uh, uh, in fact we are on it, but give us some more time. This is what the center says. Uh, the center says the, the the importance of this affidavit is that this is the first affidavit filed uh, by the center in the Supreme Court on the uh, uh, raging uh, Uniform Civil Code dispute and the center says that uh, the process is on the, the issue had been referred uh, to the 21st law commission which had in fact come out with a, a study paper and uh, uh, wide elaborate uh, discussions are still on uh, but when, the, when it was on the term of the 21st law commission expired and now uh, when the 20, uh, 22nd law commission has been constituted and once its chairman and members have been appointed the matter will be once again be taken up and discussed with the stakeholders. At the same time, the affidavit says that uh, Article uh, 44 of the Directive Principles of State Policy says that the state must endeavour to uh, draft a uh, uh, uniform civil code across the con across the uh, across the country for the benefit of the all this all its citizens to end discrimination, especially among women in matters of uh, divorce, maintenance, alimony, inheritance, and. Uh, uh, succession. So uh, the Supreme Court, the center has said that the Supreme Court should stay away and sh and reject the prayer of the uh, petitioner Ashwini Upadhyay to uh, to draft uh, UCC uh, within three months. And very significantly, as you rightly put, it also says that uh, different religions and religions and, and says that uh, different religions and denominations following uh, separate rules regarding divorce, property, and maintenance is an affront on the country's unity. So uh, the message coming out of the affidavit is that the center says that it is in the process of drafting a uniform civil code but will require more time and uh, such petitions should not be uh, entertained by the Supreme Court as these are matters of, uh, these are policy matters and, and the Supreme Court cannot issue a mandamus or a direction uh, to the uh, center to implement the UCC. Uh, so uh, this is what the affidavit says and uh, the center wants to take its own time and cannot rush through because because the matter is very important and sensitive in nature. Remember, uh, even uh, Kiran Rijuju, the, uh, the law minister, had told the parliament that there cannot be a time frame for drafting UCC because these matters are very sensitive and uh, requires in-depth study. So uh, the affidavit also, affidavit filed by the centre is also uh, in conformity, going by the tone and tenor of the government stand on the issue. Back to you. All right, Harish, thanks very much for joining us with those exclusive details.